All right, so what we're gonna talk about today is YouTube influencer sponsorship. All right, now I only accept tools from one company. I used to accept uh, free tools from other companies, but in one video, I actually gave an absolute honest review and they threatened to sue me. They said, delete all the videos that you made of our product or we are gonna take you to court. And so I deleted all those videos. All right, so the only tool brand that I accept free tools from is Hilti. All right, and I'll tell you why. But before I do, I wanna give a huge shout out to Tool, Tool Review Zone for uploading your most recent video. I just got done watching it, which that motivated me to do this video, and that's why I'm filming this now. Hilti uh, saw my channel. They, they absolutely loved it. She saw most of my Hilti videos, and by the way, most of my Hilti videos is of the Hilti tool losing to another brand. Just so you guys know. She saw this video. This is one of the videos she saw. This Milwaukee completely destroyed this Hilti. And I bought this, by the way. This one was, this was not sent to me. I bought this. And she saw this video along with some other videos, and she loved it. She absolutely loved it. She contacted me. She has uh, she uh, had tools that she wanted to send me and uh, sponsor me for those videos. And I said yes. Uh, and zero strings attached. Zero. I could do whatever I wanted with it as long as I make a video of it. That's all I had to do is make a video. She didn't tell me what. She didn't tell. It, she didn't tell me what the tool was doing, how to act it, what battery to use. She just sent me a tool with a bunch of batteries. I have like six. I have like six Hilt, Hilti 4 amp hour batteries now. And so when it comes, to, uh, she sent me this for free. I did one video of this. I've just been so busy. I haven't uh, been able to upload the videos that I promised I would. I still haven't uh, did a video on my DeWalt 60 volt flex, uh, 60 volt flex volt comp air compressor. I bought that like a year and a half to two years ago. I still haven't done a video on that yet. I'm so behind on videos. But to prove my unbiasedness, I am going to do this right now. Okay, so this was a sponsored video. Alrighty, so today what we are going to do is we are actually going to test out the brand new compact Hilti drill driver. Now, I'm thinking this thing is awesome. I was excited to get it. I did not buy this. Hilti did send this to me. I thank you very much, Miss Wilson. And so I did the video, and so sh she loved it. So I'm going to show you how unbiased I am by telling you the truth about this based on my experience with other, uh, with other tools. All right, so what we're going to do here, we're going to do one task. We're going to drive in a 10-inch lag. Let's see which one fails. Now, unfortunately, when it comes to the Hilti, this doesn't have a handle. So we'll see what happens. And battery check really quick. The battery on the Milwaukee is three bars. The battery on the Hilti is four bars. So I'm actually giving Hilti the advantage of having a full battery when the Milwaukee doesn't. And I, I already know who's gonna win because I know which one can do this task. I don't do pre-drilled holes because that defeats the purpose. All right, uh, it's on drill, speed one, battery's full. All right, ready, go. And that's where it cuts out. Let's do it one more time. That's as much as I'm gonna make it do. All right, so let's do the Milwaukee next with its 10 inch lag. Right here should be decent. All right, so ready, go. Time. Let's see if Milwaukee could finish off Hilti's uh, lag. All right, ready? Go. Time. Uh, I think we have a winner here. All right, so as you can see, I'm really not too worried about Hilti being mad about that because before they even contacted me to uh, send me free tools, I already had a lot of Hilti videos out there that were losing. I'm not worried about it, and you wanna know why? Because Hilti is a badass company that backs up their products. 
That's why. Any other company that gives you free stuff and you need to compromise the, the, the test or the video to make that company look better, then I, I wouldn't even accept it. So Flex, if you guys contacted me, I, I would be like, why can't I do this? Why can't I do that? Why must I do this? I, would, I wouldn't have accepted you. you know, and plus, after all, after you accept uh, free tools from Hilti, you know, how can you go down from that? You know, and so when it comes to Hilti, Hilti's a badass company for allowing me to do these tests like this with their tools that they give me for free. Other companies need to have the same motto as, as Hilti does. You know, I just showed you that Hilti lost. Hilti, Hilti got its ass kicked. I guarantee you that the, my contact over at Hilti is going to thank me for an honest video. You know, it's a badass video and they're going to say, hey, we're, we're getting more stuff out soon. I'll, I'll contact you as soon as that stuff's, uh, that stuff's available. Because, Miss Wilson, you're badass. All right, so the last thing I wanted to talk about is YouTube settings. All right, so I've watched a lot of Flex videos. And one thing I haven't seen is a sponsorship card on these videos. If you say, I'm just letting you YouTube creators know, if you say this is sponsored by or a company gave you a product, you legally have to click that uh, paid, ad, the paid promotion or product placement uh, option. You legally have to do that because if YouTube really wanted to, they could shut your channel down like that because you legally have to click that if a company gives you tools, I did. Uh, I legally clicked that when Hilti gave me this. I'll show you that picture right. I'll show you that clip right now. And so even so, even if you sponsor yourself, you have to click that this is sponsored. You have to. It's legal, and you have to click that option because you guys know how YouTube is. Uh, you guys know when you guys upload a video, all all the settings that they have you do now all the rules that they're making every all their YouTube creators follow. If you guys do not click that, I'll, I'll show you where it is. If you guys don't click that option and you're reviewing uh, a product that a company gave you, and even if you say it, that, that you didn't buy this, that this was sent to you, you still legally have to click that uh, paid promotion or product placement option. Because if YouTube really wanted to, they could just flat out shut your channel down. And so even if it's yourself, if I say this is sponsored by MCT, I legally have to say that this is a sponsored video. And that's how it is. And I feel, I actually, I feel ner a little nervous for you guys that haven't clicked that yet. Because if you click on that, it will show up every so often on your video on the bottom left that this is a paid promotion. And so, yeah. So I highly recommend you YouTube creators, if you guys get free stuff, you legally have to click it that it's a paid promotion and or product placement. It's an option uh, on your uh, first screen that you, when you're uploading a video. Seriously, give Hilti major props. Major props. So that's pretty much it, you guys. I hope you found this video helpful and entertaining. Please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time. <music>